we all know that eventually Goku surpasses everybody, but this time it does seem different because it's been the entirety of the super adaption and Goku is is not even stronger than the first stepping stone god which is Beerus. There have been indications that he has been all throughout the series and the first time was when he went Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken. That was when you really thought okay so if he's Super Saiyan Blue times 20 surely he's stronger than Beerus but it turns out no Beerus is it is beyond even that, and it's almost like they keep bumping up Beerus' power just to try and make Goku's ceiling way higher. When he went Ultra Instinct, that was a pretty clear indication that if he's not stronger than Beerus, he's pretty close. It's the closest he's ever been. However, recent chapters indicate that Beerus is still way above Goku, and he's still way above everybody. It's all about giving Goku room to grow. I mean, think about it. It was easy when he was 12 years old and a kid, and the series was just starting out. The peak of someone's power was maybe destroying a building. Now, to showcase power you're skipping into different dimensions and realities it's getting very difficult to showcase how powerful these guys are really getting and that's only going to continue as the series keeps going on the reason they never let Beerus go all out is because if they did there would be a definitive ceiling to his power and as the series goes on Goku gets stronger it would make him eventually surpass Beerus and one day that might happen but it hasn't happened yet. In the latest arc of the story, you have a guy wishing to be the strongest in the universe, but Beerus and the gods don't get included in that. It's only with the mortals. So it really puts him onto this whole other tier list that if you look back on this arc in the next few years, you'd see, kind of like when Kaioken x 20 came out, Goku still has a long way to go, and that's going to keep on happening until eventually the series grows out of these... I want to say training wheels and moves past the end of Z. That's when we can get out of this beta phase and hold nothing back. Goku has been thought to surpass Beerus at least 58 different times now and I'm telling you it's never going to be official until you see Beerus at 100%. Until then they're going to keep subtly rising his power no matter how strong Goku gets. Beerus' power has been rising. Remember when they said Beerus was a 10, Goku was a 6 in their first fight? Within 12 months that scale was outdated because they rose Beerus' power. The same thing's going to keep on happening until you see Beerus really go all out at 100%. Not counting any other god, it's pretty clear that Beerus, as far as power goes, is among the top. Universe 9 god was controlled and pretty much overwhelmed with Freeze's power, so you could probably say Goku's stronger than him, but Beerus is the main target. You don't care about Universe 9 God, you don't even care about Universe Anything God. Beerus is really the only one that matters, and even Jiren and Universe 11. That whole dynamic of the mortal being stronger than gods, that was just Jiren in relation to the Universe 11 God, Belmoud. Jiren wasn't being compared to every god, just his own god. So that's why saying Goku beat Jiren, therefore he's stronger than all the other gods, that's probably true for the Universe 11 God, but Beerus has been shown to be one of the strongest gods. Throughout recent stories, it was made pretty clear that Beerus may be getting left behind because of his lack of caring, lack of training, but it turns out that, I mean, Beerus has been around for millions of years, he doesn't need to train that much, and as the story goes on, he just naturally gets more powerful. In the immediate short term, do you see Goku surpassing Beerus? Absolutely not. They're gonna draw this out as long as they possibly can, because as long as Beerus is this wall, this ceiling for Goku to keep climbing to, it's going to give them a lot of room to work with Goku's power scale, and it would be... A big moment. It's not something that they would just kind of throw out there. Oh yeah, Goku's surpassed Beerus now. When it happens, it will be made very clear. There won't be any guessing games of, oh, maybe this time. I, I guess you could maybe argue this point. The way the series is now, or at least this story arc, it's not set up for Goku to overthrow Beerus or surpass Beerus or be like that Jiro and the mortal stronger than gods. It probably will happen one day, but for right now, those are the reasons why it hasn't happened yet. And that's it. 